Hi everyone and welcome back to another episode of how to be a bet. Show some bit love, subscribe and ring the bell so you get notified for the next videos. Today we will be talking about jealousy among women. Let me tell you something very important here. For all the women that want to join my tribe, you need to know one of the most important attributes a bit has. She is not jealous of other women because she knows that being jealous is not classy. Being jealous is very low. Being jealous always implies that I don't feel good about myself. I don't think I can be in the place that this person is, so I need to put this person down. And everybody understands that. All bitches have very high self-esteem or they pretend to have a very high self-esteem and by pretending that you get there in no time. You have no idea how much more attractive and elevated you will look in the eyes of other people once you start uplifting other women. You have no idea how much power we all have once we start supporting each other. Never talk negative about other women, never criticize other women. We are here to uplift each other. We are here to support each other against patriarchy. Let me break it down to you. Let me first tell you that everybody has been there we've all felt jealous there is a repetitive pattern so I'm gonna break it down to you and I'm gonna try to show you how this works and how you can change it to benefit yourself you see a beautiful woman you like a lot what you see but deep down she is threatening to you because you believe that you will never be able to reach her level you don't believe that you can look like her so you need to find a way to make her less threatening. How? By downing her in order to lift yourself up. So you start criticizing her, you find something and you focus there talking about this thing that she's doing that you don't like, you make it bigger in your head. So this makes you feel relieved and safe. You're like, I'm not like her. When you really don't like a person, you don't pay attention to them. You don't talk about them because you don't like them, so they don't trigger you. Let me give you an example. You go to the supermarket. You will go to the aisles that have the products that you want to buy, right? Are you going to stay in an aisle of all these products that you will never purchase? No. So why talking about the women that you really don't like and that you really don't approve of. And this doesn't only happen with women, it happens everywhere. When you hear a person talking a lot about what they don't like, about the people that they don't like, about a situation that they don't like, are you sure that they actually don't like these people? They don't like the situations they are describing? Because why I get the feeling that it is the other way around? Because when you don't like something, when you don't want something, you don't pay any attention to that. It's like the example of the supermarket that I have just given you. When you're not interested in a product and a person in a video and a woman why are you keep talking about her why are you keep talking about this product they say that your haters are your biggest fans and I couldn't agree more while watching this video I don't want you to be defensive you don't need to admit that you are a jealous person to anybody but yourself this video is only for you to do the homework for yourself another thing that can happen is when you go out with your boyfriend and he is looking at other women which is very devastating and it is very hurtful no man should ever do that and you should definitely set the boundaries and address this issue this is not okay and this is not normal but what you should not do is talk sh about the other women that your man is looking at because it's not their fault if your boyfriend is cheating on you it's not the other woman's fault what i'm trying to say here is that everybody should be responsible for what they are doing because there are many many women out there that they accuse the woman that is cheating with her husbands without even thinking of accusing the man who is looking at them or cheating accusing their man is something they will never think about but accusing the other women is always the first choice right how smart is this now now let me tell you how to flip the script and how to change this situation to benefit yourself. First of all, I gotta tell you, there is not such a thing as an ugly woman, but there is such a thing as a woman that doesn't pay a lot of attention to herself, that goes out of the house looking like who did and why. So the next time that you feel threatened by a woman, you need to acknowledge that. You need to acknowledge that you feel jealousy. That's the first thing that you can do. The second thing that you can do is try to understand that you deserve to be like her you can get there so instead of seeing her as a threat try to get inspired by her instead try to be like oh she is so pretty i want to look like her collect photos of the women that you feel that they are very threatening slash attractive and do anything possible to be like them and you know what you can do that and maybe you will end up looking way way better than these women that were threatening first place make friends with these women because when you hang out with the people that you really really like that you feel that they 
they are very attractive, that you want something that they have, you end up having it yourself. Be smart and use them as an example of what you can achieve. Don't let your low self-esteem bring you even more lower talking shit about these people. How are you gonna benefit if you talk shit about other people? If other people listen to you talking shit about this kind of women, they know that you have low self-esteem. They know that deep down you're jealous. But when you listen to a woman talking about another woman using very nice words, showing appreciation, you have no idea how much more attractive you look when you talk nice about other women. And I'm gonna tell you another secret here. If you're hanging with a guy and he's like, oh, this woman is so pretty, I like her. And you go like, oh my God, yeah, you're so right. She's so perfect. She has the best hair. Then the guy will be like, yeah, she has the best hair, but you know what, her legs, I don't know if I'm very crazy about her legs, you will find something negative to say. Suddenly, this woman will have laws. If you start uplifting her, deep down he will feel jealous and he will be like, she's not that special anymore. Let me give you another hint. If you're outside with your boyfriend and there are many, many, many attractive women all around and you pretend like they don't even exist, all the attention will be back to you. I guarantee you. Give it a try and you let me know. Those tips have been tested for so long. Use the other women as an inspiration to get where you want to go in terms of looks. Men are so used to insecure women. So when they meet a woman from my tribe, a real bitch, they fall in love so deep that they cannot even see other women. All the other women don't exist. There is nothing better in this world than women supporting women. And go to the next level so that we can all defeat patriarchy and create the new feminine era. You're all so very special and there is not such a thing as a competition. Society wants us to compete. How can you compete with a person that has nothing to do with you? Nobody can be like you. There is not such a thing as a competition. You have no idea how much you can evolve when you get inspired by the women that you feel jealous but deep down what you feel is admiration which is all covered by this negativity that I'm not good enough I can never go to that level of beauty or whatever yes you can so that was all for today I really hope you like this video don't forget to subscribe hit the like button below and leave your comments share this video with your best friends and hit me up in the email in the description of the video for a personal consultation the first one is always for free see you on the next one